Close the door. Got your license? Yeah, how you doing? Got your insurance? Yeah. Hold on, what are you doing? Where is it? Is it? Yeah, give me your license out of your wallet there. Well, I need to read this. Okay. And, uh, that you're gonna violate my right to travel. <laughs> all my information on my You're welcome to. You realize that uh, I've addressed this before. You know, supervisor? You know who's our soup? Supervisor? Okay. He's a right to travel. Okay. It's four. You can go ahead and give me a uh, supervisor's turn. You have a driver's license? Uh, sir, I'm gonna have to. I have all my information on that machine. Well, I need a photo ID here in the state of Texas in order to identify you. I've stopped you for a moving violation. Okay. It's legal to do. You have no front license plate. Okay, I'm not a driver. I'm a traveler. Okay. As a Mr. traveler. Mr. Ripson. Yes, sir. How you doing? Yes, sir. We're not here to discuss the politics of what you believe and don't believe in. Sure. We respect that view. Sure. But you've got to understand that uh, for the most part, all voters are required to have a driver's license and show proof of insurance while traveling the state of Texas. Okay. All right. I'm We've got a supervisor in route. 254. We're at Galloway and Children's Barnes Bridge at the Stop and Shop gas station. Okay? We don't have to. All right, we'll just remain in your seat here. We'll be right back with you. Get out of the gym. Pulled him over coming up Childress for no front license plate. Okay. He's got no bumper, no front license plate. Okay. So I turned him around on him and he was hauling up here. Okay. So he pulls in here, opens up his wallet. He's got a valid, he's got a DL in there. Uh -huh. Won't get, gets all shaky, won't give it to me. Presents me with this. Oh right, yeah. Right to travel. Yeah, so that means nothing to us. He's got um, histories for 55, 10, 11. Uh, his last arrest was 2016 out of Rockwall for DWLI. Okay. So they're obviously this isn't the first time. Yeah. So that'll enhance if he won't sign it. Okay. Uh, so he's, he's refused to sign a ticket? I haven't yeah. presented it to him yet. I was going to. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, he can sign it or we'll, he'll, we'll place him under arrest. Is that where we are with each other? Yeah. We just wanted you to come out. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, we. Be here because usually they want a supervisor. Yeah, I get it. Yeah. yeah. If I got to break his window to get him out. Uh, all that goes with I mean? it. So. Yeah, let's see if he'll sign it. We'll go to the Mr. Richardson, yes. I have a citation Are you gonna... for no front license plate and driving while your license is invalid. I have that already at you. Another notation. I have that already at you. Just say he's not signing it. You decided to take it or go to You jail. still have no front license plate. Okay. Your choice. But I'm just saying that. I don't want to read it. This is about the ticket. I don't care. It's not an admission of guilt, simply an agreement that you contact our court within 12 business days. Down at the bottom? On the signature line? You come down to court, you can bring those documents, sure. and if it's valid, then let the judge deal with it. Spelled duress wrong. Oh, it's the misspell of How do you spell it? D-U-R-E-S-S. -S. Wrong. If you're going to be confrontational, you need to spell it right, okay? The litter does not count, okay? Now, you shouldn't put your seatbelt on. You should obey all the Texas rules. You may not think the rules, but guess what? They are. And if you don't, if you get out of here and we see you make a violation, we're going to pull you over and we're going to take you to jail. Do you understand those constitutional rights? Yes, sir. Good. Because you do have a criminal history. 
And should you wish to take this to court, everything I said to you is being recorded and photographed right now. Your badge number is? You've got it, 382. Yeah. I could hand you a piece of paper telling you I don't want to give it to you, but that's not how we operate. You want to operate outside the rules, but you don't want everybody else to. Sir, I saw Yeah. Can you say the badge number was? You got it. I already told you. Now, if you want to re redo it, that's for open information. Okay? Put your seatbelt on. When's the last time you were arrested? I don't recall. I oh, really? Okay. Convenient. Considering it wasn't that long ago. This is going to cost you somewhere in around over a thousand dollars because you've already had a DWL out before. Okay? It's still not valid. So I don't know how you're going to get off this parking lot without violating the law. Oh, so if I leave the parking lot, you're going to arrest it's, me? It's prima facie evidence. Okay? We have a problem there, don't we? See how the laws work? For and against you? So you can take your feet and go on down the road. That's not illegal. As long as you obey all the pedestrian laws. Now, you might want to crack those law books and let me know what that's all about, okay? The piece of paper you gave me, I'm keeping because it's invalid. You got to sign the bottom of the document and date it to make it anything valid. You should have read up on that, okay? Go back to your law library and check that out. What I think happens, last time you arrested for DWI, is you got us yourself a jailhouse lawyer in there next to you saying, hey, here's what you need to do to mess with the police, okay? Well, guess what? I've been doing this 33 years. I don't care, all right? Now, listen closely. Do not leave the parking lot driving their vehicle. It's illegal, okay? Look at me. Do you understand me? I do. Good. I want to see those eyes. I want to make sure you understand. Because I'm, I'm not thinking everything's all there. The earth is round. Give me his receipt. Yeah. Where are you going? You got any money? I don't know if they take that American currency. You don't think so? I don't know. They may not. Because it may not be constitutional. That, that, that's, a, that's an American document you got there. Are you saying that they're not constitutional? I'm not sure. You don't know? You never know where you're going to... There may be a crazy person there you might get a hold of. I don't know. Good luck to you. Likewise. Oh, are we good? All right, we're good. We good? Yeah, we Okay. Good talk. Go on. See you soon. Now you will. I hope not. Okay. Put your shirt on. It's a health code violation if you don't. It's not outside. I know the law. Outside is fine. No, everybody have a sign. It doesn't say shoot yourself in the head either, I think. Does it? There's no sign for that, is it? Shoot yourself in the head. Yeah. What are you saying?